So what's up guys? Welcome to Rafa's Garage. Today I'm working on the Corolla today. We got uh, the space plates for a single DIN right here. Um, and I got this old Pioneer from either my Evo or my Celica. I don't remember, but this has Bluetooth that doesn't. I have to connect always to usb do this into my music and i don't like that so i'm gonna put a single din that's all i care about just bluetooth uh i don't care about this fancy um double din uh the touch screen doesn't work so i can't put my sub i can't you know adjust anything or the bluetooth i'm pretty sure it has bluetooth but stereo doesn't work anymore so yep i bought this from amazon i'll leave a link in the description and then just install this, fairly easy. So all I gotta do is just pop this out. I took off my little uh, cell phone holder and this is just by clips, just comes off real quick. And that's all I get, need to, to get access to the stereo and that's it, um, fairly easy. <laughs> So there it is, unplugged everything. Uh, that's your antenna, that's for my sub. Um, and this is the harness for this one. This is the way you actually do a stereo. Well, basically you gotta buy these plugs and it's fairly easy off of that. Um, you just gotta match the colors. Uh, mines are a little short, but I'm gonna tap into those. So white goes with white purple goes with purple there are color coordinates to your harness so it's fairly easy um and then this blue one right here that is i'm not sure if you can see it that blue one is for the amp this is just the extended usb that goes down there um so might remove this one i don't need it anymore and yeah, I'm gonna put these easy connectors that I'm able to, you know, remove just in case I ever want to swap it again with a different one. So I'm gonna use those. Um, but yeah, so this wire harness, I'm not gonna need it anymore. Same thing with this relay. took a while because it had an electrical tape and then they just did twist and pull this orange one i'm not going to use it that's for video um but the other ones i am i did put uh connectors already on the yellow and the red um one of them does have direct source power so that's why i put it um and then the other one is just for the ignition turns on when um gives a signal when it ignitions is on that way it turns on the stereo so i'm gonna start putting all of these um males on them and then on the stereo over here i'm gonna put all the females and then just plug it up real quick try it out and then put the little single din on here and make it work should be fairly easy now halfway through uh, a little less than halfway through now i just gotta do the females on these and like i said it's just straightforward color coordinate the green with green the white with white the gray with gray and then the yellow black and red they're all the same colors um just watch out uh the speaker ones are like they're double white so one of them has that little black stripe. That means that's the ground. So make sure you connect it to the white with black stripe. It's fairly easy. I'm gonna start putting the females and then connected it, test fitting it, make sure it works. And then putting... Got 
everything together now to plug them up to the right colors and plug it into the stereo turn it on hopefully it works and install the sub turns on there it is it turns on everything's working i connected it now i just got to put everything back together put the single din on and basically connect the sub um and hopefully it works This is how it goes you got to put this big piece first with the long thick screw right here and then you also got four little screws that are smaller those go on the side and these should be labeled this one's the left she has it somewhere right there um, should have it somewhere on here um, and then that's how this one's gonna go and the screws are gonna be one right there and one in there this is gonna sit but see as it inside it's the right hand so I'm gonna put this one on slap it on there um, I'm also have to put these on there and these on there to secure it better so that's what I'm gonna do real quick so everything's already connected i put the mic right here just pass it through there pass it through the where the gauge is at and it just goes up there fairly easy put everything back together, install the sub, and hopefully it works. So there it is, already installed. I went with the white and red, what do you guys think? <laughs> Now that everything's connected, let's install this kicker. Amp is already installed. I just gotta take off all this stuff. So there it is. The amp is right here. Ah, uh, here's the wire. Let's connect it real quick. So there it is. I think it's already done. Now to put everything back together, probably gonna put the app right there. I'm gonna drill it right now and then put everything back together and call it a day. So there it is. I actually drilled it right here. It's not going anywhere. So kind of hidden. Only thing that's gonna be there is a speaker. So I just gotta put everything back together and that's it there it is all my tools my sub my tools for work yeah. but i kind of like it corolla is very spacious as far as the trunk not anymore because the sub but it is what it is so that's it guys thanks for watching please like subscribe and i'm out